as if by magic, authentic experiences are created when using storytelling methods. But it's important to remember that a poorly crafted story can lead to a bad experience. So here, three things you must avoid when using storytelling in your design process. Turning the client into the story protagonist. It's important to remember that the client who commissioned the work is not the primary audience for your experience. They can provide valuable insights about the intended audience, but they cannot be, and should not be, the main focus of your story. Creating imaginary stories that bear no relevance in the real world. An imaginary story won't solve the user real life problems. If a story doesn't resonate with the life we live in, then there is no reason for the user to stick around. So, always focus on the audience's actual needs and goals and base them on data and research. My advice? Use your imagination to solve genuine problems. Crafting beautiful stories. Did this point confuse you? I know. Many people confuse storytellers with writers, but we are UX storytellers, which means we recognize that storytelling is a practical tool to create user experiences, but we don't use it to write stories in a literal sense. So when we think about storytelling in design, there is no need of once upon a time. During my workshop, I will delve deeper into these common mistakes and demonstrate how storytelling can become second nature to you. See you there!